Hey everyone, welcome to the Move More YouTube channel. I'm Marissa. Let's get started with some chair yoga. Everyone just begin with having a seat. Thank you all so much for being here. I'm super excited. I really, really enjoy chair yoga. And it's really just because it's something that's nice and calm and easy to do. And you can do it any time of the day, night. It's not gonna work you up. It is literally just gonna help you calm yourself down and relax. So let's get started. Let's place our hands on our legs. So I've got my knees and ankles in line with each other and my knees are in line with my hips. I'm just placing my hands in a comfortable spot. And we're gonna get started with our breath. This always begins with your breath, just calming things down. So if you'd like, you can close your eyes. And let's start with just not changing anything. Keep breathing as you are, but become aware of it. Are you breathing really shallow? Is your heart pumping? Are you breathing really fast? Now let's start to make a change. Let's take a deep breath in through the nose. And let's let it out through the mouth. Good, keep this going. As you breathe, you start to notice whenever you inhale, you might be sitting up a little bit taller. You might be turning that tailbone under and drawing the belly button in towards the spine. Good. With each exhale, you can start to feel the muscles falling and relaxing a little bit. You notice your shoulders are dropping. You notice your legs and your hips are starting to relax. And if it's not, try to actively let it relax. Keep breathing in through the nose and out through the mouth. Starting to feel just a little bit more relaxed? I hope so. Next, we're gonna start rolling our shoulders. So I'm gonna lift my shoulders up to the ears and then I'm gonna start rolling them to the back and just begin to make big circles with the shoulders. Really opening the chest when you lean to the back and then drawing it in when you're to the front. Still keeping that breath nice and calm in through the nose and out through the mouth. Awesome, now let's reverse those circles. So now we're bringing it up and really focus on the shrug to the front. Open the chest. It's nice and slow. Moving the shoulders up and down. Okay, now we're gonna take one at a time. So I'm gonna begin to start twisting in my spine. So I'm lifting my right shoulder up and I'm gonna gently twist towards the right. My focus and hips and everything stays to the front. Just a very, very gentle twist. And reverse bringing the shoulders one at a time to the front. Still paying attention to your breath. And let's let everything come back to a neutral spot. Very good, let's take our arms down to the side. Right now we're in our somewhat mountain pose. So we're sitting down, we have our shoulders drawn back, our chest lifted, our tummy's tucked in, our chin is slightly tucked back. So there's one long line from the neck down to the spine palms facing front. Really open those fingers up. Let energy shoot out of each finger. My arms are activated. Keep breathing. It's nice when you're sitting in a chair because you don't have to actually like hold poses so you can really relax and let that breath control you and control how much you can relax. Great. On your next inhale, let's draw the arms up overhead and bringing my palms together. Now keep the arms up, but let's relax the shoulders down and draw them away from the ears. Keep lifting with the chest. Keep the core tight. On your next exhale, let's lean to one side. So I'm leaning to my left. So I'm keeping the core nice and tight. 
I'm not lifting my hips up. It's just a stretch from the hip up through the shoulder and into the fingertips, really reaching. And on your inhale, bring everything back to center. And exhale, reverse the lean. It's nice and easy. You can do these stretches anywhere, anytime. People may look at you like you're funny, but at least you know you'll feel better when you're done. And inhale, back to center. From here, I'm bringing my elbows down first, leaving my fingertips up to the ceiling. Palms forward. Really press the shoulders down and really draw the shoulder blades together in the back. Take a deep breath in through the nose. Exhale, push it out through the mouth. Begin to draw the elbows and the palms together in front of you. Inhale, open back up. And exhale, draw it together. Inhale, open. Exhale, draw it together one more time. And we're gonna pause here for just a moment. If you're not able to bring your elbows together, lower the arms until you can. And then after they're brought together, then you can focus on lifting them back up. If you are able to bring your elbows together, then continue to lift up until you can't and stop at that moment when they part. Pause and come back and let the elbows join together at that limit. One more deep breath in. Exhale. On our next inhale, let's draw the arms up overhead. Really reach. On our exhale, we're folding forward. Bring the hands in front of you. Stop where you're comfortable. If you need to stop and rest your elbows, that's okay. You can use your hands to hold and support yourself. If you want to continue to go down, you can use your shins, or you can let that belly fall all the way over onto your thighs and place the hands on your feet. If you'd like, you can take the ball of your foot and place your hand underneath it just to get a really good deep stretch in the wrist, elbows, and shoulders. It also lifts your toes off the ground, so you're getting a little extra stretch in that foot and the calf. And begin to release the hands if you're all the way down. And we're going to lift halfway up. So let's place the hands on the knees. And we're going to lengthen the spine. And let's have the head in line with the spine so your eyes should be gazing down at the floor. Good. Keeping the hands here. On your next inhale, you're lifting your focus up to the ceiling, drawing that belly towards the front of the room. And when we exhale, we're gonna draw the chin into the chest and begin to round the spine back. So drawing that belly back to the back of the chair. So rounding in the back. Inhale, lifting up. Take the focus up to the ceiling. Exhale, round it out. Let's do this two more times. Inhale, look up. Exhale, down. Last one, give it all you got. Inhale, up. And exhale, really round everything out. And inhale, coming back to a natural seated position. Very good, everyone. Taking our arms back down by the side, we're gonna lift them up to a T position. With my palms facing the front of the room with my thumbs facing up to the ceiling. And I'm just gonna begin to make a small circle. So we're really activating the back of the shoulders, those arms, just the, everything from fingertips all the way to the spine is lit up right now. Good, nice small circles. And now let's reverse. Let's turn the circles to the back. Very good. Keep the thumbs up. Take a deep breath in, pause the circles, lift the chest. 
On our exhale, I'm drawing my right arm across my body. I'll bring my left arm to support it at the forearm. My thumb is still up to the ceiling. I am now just stretching deep into the back of the shoulder and into those triceps. From here, let's make a fist. Let's draw that hand in and we're gonna curl that wrist in. And now we're gonna open the hand up, draw the fingertips to the front of the room. Back into the curl, fist, and open back up. One more time, fist, and open. Good, let's open those hands back to that T position. Inhale, open the chest. Exhale, getting ready to reverse. Draw the left arm across the body, use the right arm to support it. Thumb is up to the ceiling, really stretching in that shoulder. Let's bring that hand into a curled up fist and open the fingers up to the front. Bring it back into a fist and curl it out. Curl it in and extend it out. One more time, draw it in and back out. Awesome. Open back out to the T, thumbs up. Inhale, take the arms up. And exhale, reach back over towards the floor. All right, so from here on your next inhale, we're gonna lift our hips out of the chair. Inhale, pushing all the weight into the feet. Begin to straighten the knees, lifting the hips up to the floor, up to the ceiling, <laughs> away from the floor. You can drop the crown of the head, letting it fall to the floor. And with each exhale, try to fold yourself over just a little bit more. And again, if you're not able to touch the floor, that's okay. If you wanna use the chair, you can always turn around and let this chair help you and hold you up for support. Find yourself something that makes it comfortable for you. But if you are able to lean over, let that upper body hold the weight to pull down to really stretch those hamstrings. All right, guys, so we're gonna leave our left hand down to the ground. On our next inhale, we're gonna to begin to twist and take that right arm up to the ceiling. At this point, my right leg is slightly bent, but my left leg has a really deep bend in it. If I turn to the side, you can see. So just where you need, you can bend both of the knees. We're just beginning to twist in the spine. And let's come back to center. Planting the right hand, getting ready to reverse, twisting that left arm up to the ceiling. We've got this, so my right knee is now at a good bend. My left leg is my base leg, really reaching that left arm up. Take the focus with you if you can. Awesome job, back down to center. And let's find our chair, so let's lower the bottom back down and begin to sit yourself back. Awesome job. Take a deep breath in, bring the arms up, and exhale, lower the arms down to the thighs. My knees are back to the original spot. My ankles and knees are in line with each other, and my knees are in line with my hips. I'm going to draw my right knee up to my chest. That means I'm going to shift my weight into that left leg and slowly begin to draw the right knee up, and let's use those hands to support the knee. Sit up nice and tall. Try not to slouch too far back. You've got this, you're almost done. Just a nice, quick 15 minute session here, guys. Good, deep breath in. Exhale, try to pull that knee just a little bit closer. And let's put a flex in that foot. And point, and flex, and point. Let's draw a circle with the toe. And reverse. Whoo, and let's Place that right foot back down on the ground in line with the right hip. It's shifting the weight over to the right. Begin to pick the left leg up. Use those hands to support the knee. Sit up tall and draw the knee into the chest. And flex that foot and point and flex and point. Begin to make a circle with the toe and reverse. Awesome, put that foot down on the ground, you guys. Place the hands down by the side. Inhale, take the arms up. Let's draw the palms together. 
And we're gonna begin to lower the hands and drawing the elbows out to the side. Let's bring the thumbs into the heart. Sit up tall, deep breath in through the nose. And close those eyes out through the mouth. Really draw the shoulders down and back into the nose. Out through the mouth. And let's lower the hands down to the thighs. Place your hands wherever you are comfortable. And we finish here today being grateful for this time, taking time out for you. Sometimes it's just 15 minutes. That's all it takes. You do that every day. You'll be amazed at how different you feel. Keep breathing in through the nose and out through the mouth. If you enjoyed this class, please hit that like button when you're done. It really helps get these classes out there for more people. In through the nose. And out through the mouth. Last breath, everyone. Biggest breath you've taken all class. In through the nose. Fill everything you have on the inside with air. And push it out. Awesome, everyone. Begin to open the eyes, move the hands and the feet. Thank you all so very much for joining me. I hope you have a great rest of the day.